Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Deasia. I have quite a few things that I need to do today. So I'm going axe throwing today, which I'm really excited about. And I'm also going to take myself to watch Creed. But before I can do that, I have to get, you know, my responsibilities out of the way. My responsibilities being pole and the gym. I feel like I've been going to pole long enough to be able to go to the pole and the gym because I've always been going to the gym. It's really time that I start doubling up on those days. Like probably not gonna go as hard at the gym. I have pole at 12, it's currently 11, 12. Um, I have to leave here for like 11.30, so I have about 15 minutes to get ready. I have pole at 12. From 12 to 1, I'm just taking one pole class because I don't want to take two pole classes and then not be able to go to the gym. And then right after pole, I'm going to take myself straight to the gym, stretch out my splits, then start my workout, and then I'm going to come back. So I know I'm going to go to axe throwing later on in the day, maybe around like 5, 30, 6 o'clock. And the night, I'm going to take myself to watch Creed. I'm just going to get ready really quickly. I'm not going to put on like makeup or too much makeup i should say literally just a little bit i'm just gonna cover a few hyperpigmentation marks i got this new mac studio fix concealer and i actually really love it it looks a little light at first but this just matches my skin tone i always tell myself oh i'm not gonna wear makeup because my skin needs to breathe and then i always end up putting on makeup it does dry really fast so i'm gonna let it sit and then I'm going to work on my edges. I started using the Easy Edges Edge Control. It's like a beeswax. This is probably the best edge control I've ever used. I think, I think this is my new go-to. These edges, I did these edges yesterday afternoon. Yesterday afternoon, I only slept with the bonnet on. I didn't even tie it down. I did tie it down with my, my scarf at first um, when I first did it. Look at how it's still pretty much there this edge control holds and this is not the first time it's done this i don't even think i need to redo that part now i'm not gonna do like super cute complex edges i have that little spiral there but i feel like you're not really seeing that but it was cute it was cute yesterday i look you want to leave it Now I'm just going to take my edges scarf and tie it down while I finish my makeup. I don't even want to feel like I'm wearing too much makeup because I'm just I'm going to the gym after. I think I'm just going to put on this concealer and then some lashes. And that's it. I lied. I'm wearing a little bit more than just concealer. I'm still trying to find my everyday natural makeup look i see that some girls do just a little contour i think i'm even gonna put on a little um concealer first this is like my first time wearing this much makeup to the gym and i find that i usually like if i do sweat i sweat on my forehead I literally just want to conceal those hyperpigmentation marks and that's pretty much it and then some lashes of course and I think I'm pretty satisfied with this it literally looks like a no makeup makeup look in my opinion I'm just gonna put my hair up in a new ponytail and it is 11 28 so I'm actually running on time and I'm now ready to go to poll. It is 11.30, so I do have to leave right now. So let's start this day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow my Instagram and TikTok and Twitter down below. I'll link them on the screen as well.
again even worse this time because the skin like ripped i don't know if you guys can see so i'm gonna invest in some gloves because this is not cute on days like today i want to be able to like stay for open time so i can kind of just leave whenever i want okay, so but i like find that my hands like like i don't know they like do this Does yeah houses? Do that? yeah oh yeah totally it's like a oh thing oh my gosh yeah. okay. you learn to get proud of them have them all over yeah but it's like Oh, my leg like, yeah. ripped today. Like you get the, oh, yeah. Such a baby one. <laughs> <laughs> now you're able to take things like climbs and combos. You're able to take climbs and inversions. You're able to take low Oh, flow. really? So there's like a half level. See you later, Brittany. Bye. It's called climbs and inversions that happens on Sundays. And uh -huh. you have access to that one as well. And you can take low flow as well. And then if you're into like really, really fast choreography, you can also take erotica. So low flow and erotica are both choreography classes. Those are so, oh, yeah. I love that. So as you guys can see, I made it to the gym. It is currently 2.26, it's basically 2.30. I'm so sorry if this lighting is terrible. But I'm about to change and then take you guys to do my stretch. I'm not gonna take you guys to like follow me around my workout. Um, but I will take you guys for my stretching. So I'm gonna change real quick and then I'm going to get back with you guys. So today I'm gonna work on legs since I basically just did an upper body workout at whole and on top of that like my hands can't really do the most today. So I'm gonna do like a light leg workout and then just finish it off with cardio.
Alright guys, as you can see, I'm home. I already took a shower. I did just put on the same tracksuit that I was wearing because I was literally only wearing it to the car and back and I still have more places that I need to go. I just want to get the sweat off my body. But I've showered. I've also made my little lunch. I'm eating these like banana protein pancakes, but I'm eating them like it's finger food because I feel like it tastes like a different meal, especially without syrup and also it's healthier. So this is what I'm having as my quick snack. And I'm also drinking this protein juice. I have my, my protein. It literally tastes like a juice. And it is 20 grams of protein. And it's only 80 calories. So for the girlies that are trying to, you know, lose fat, grow muscle, this is what I'm drinking. It is so sweet. And there's so many different flavors. I usually have these, like, when I go to the gym. I try not to just drink it every day just for fun. I'm currently drinking the Screamin' Shower Cherry. And it's actually very sweet. It tastes good. This is actually the second bottle that I've gotten. And I do recommend because it actually tastes good. They also have other flavors. This one is the Sour Watermelon. I definitely recommend these if you're trying to increase your protein intake. This video is not sponsored. Um, and yeah, that is what I'm eating for lunch. I already called the axe throwing place that I'm going to and I scheduled my reservation. I'm going to be doing axe throwing and archery, so I'm excited. And then I also already bought my ticket to go watch Creed. I'm really excited to go to this um, archery place this archery and axe throwing place. I've never done axe throwing, but I have done archery one time when I was in like grade six. I went to this camp called Kilku, which is actually the same camp where they filmed Camp Rock. And it was actually really dope. So they took us to do like a whole bunch of activities. And we also did archery there, which was really fun. That's like my first and only time doing archery. And I was pretty good at it. So I wanna see if I'm still good at it. I'm gonna finish eating real quick. And then I'll catch up with you guys either before I go or when I get there. Have we been axe before or archery? I've never been. I've done archery actually when I was okay. like in grade six though. So that was long ago. <laughs> I still count. Still come back to you. I'll give you guys the rundown. There's a nice smooth move under here. You're going to want your feet pointed at that wall with pretty good posture. I close my left eye. It's easiest to straighten that way. Okay, I'll show you next one. Tingy's been doing good. These are mine though. I just got home from the movies. It's actually 10, 18. I watched Creed 3. It was so good. I did go by myself, but I'm not mad at it. Because, like, I actually really like going to the movies by myself. But it was so good. Creed, the Creed series, I actually love it. So I'm really happy that I went to see it. So I had a really, really productive and really good day. Like, yeah, I had a lot of fun today. I passed my poll exit test. Every time I think about that, I just get really happy. Like, I originally thought that when i passed the test that i would only be able to go into climbs and combos but now i have a whole bunch of different options like different classes that i can go to so you guys are probably going to start seeing a variety of different classes that i'm going to like classes strictly for routines or combos probably like obviously going to climbs and combos because i want to be able to like learn kind of like a step up from intro to pole i want to get to the point where i can create my own routines and i feel really comfortable just naturally learning routines that is all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please give it a thumbs up and comment down below subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed you know stay in tune with my pole dancing classes i feel like i can slowly see myself getting better i'm really excited to get into like the other classes because even the instructors really excited 
for me so I'm really excited follow my TikTok and my Instagram I'll put them on the screen and I'll link them down below just so you guys can see some more sneak peeks to what I'm learning in my pro classes and I hope to see you guys in my next video bye she must be a Jacko, baby, cause I swear she say she knows yeah. I'm so good at playing this game, I got that she goes yeah. I got a handful of bad luck, shawty, shawty